close. These people want me dead. I need to leave now. Here's the leech. Here! My head's spinning. Oi! Come out, you coward! It's locked, all right. Clever fucking beast! I'm still in Southwark. It's dead, all right. I cannot enter. the limits of my body. My poor sister. If only I had controlled my need for blood. Mary, someone will pay for what happened to you. For what happened to us. It's locked, all right. It's locked. Dizziness from the jump. I can now control it. I cannot enter. <clears throat> what will London have to say to me? It's locked. I have so many questions unanswered. Another corpse? Have the very streets of London become a mausoleum? The 
man has been drained of all blood. But I can still smell the scent of it. I follow the scent's trail. Perhaps it will lead me to my assailant. Fresh blood. The smell is so strong. Where has everyone gone? Welcome, sir, to the Turk Wars Turk. I think I'm losing my mind. I should just run as far away from this. Good evening, place sir. I wondered if I could ask for your help. Wow, you look like you need a drink. Yes. I apologize for my outfit. It's been. It's been a long night. Been there, seen that. Don't worry, things can only get worse. What's going on around here? It's like everybody is hiding. You must be new here. Have you not heard about the murders? Everybody fears the return of the sewer dog. Who is this sewer dog? It's a local bogeyman. Convenient answer for every crime that happened for decades. You murdered someone. Blame the sewer dog, eh? You make it sound like it's a fairy tale. People will always believe in monsters. It's easier than accepting their own darkness. We can all be monsters. I hope I live long enough to see them wet boot boys. Has anybody entered the bar recently? Can't say. Sorry. I spent the night making love to that gorgeous bottle, see? This is important, sir. Are you sure no one has come in here in the last few hours? I don't know and I don't care. This is a free country. People still have the right to come and go, don't they? I'll leave you to your bottle then. Whoever he may be. Hello, sir. Are you all right? Is there any way I can help you? I don't know. Maybe you could just talk to me. Maybe you prefer to speak with Tom, then. He's more agreeable talking to strangers. What's going on around here? Where is everyone? Too many dead, sir. First the epidemic, and now all these terrible murders. What have you heard about the epidemic? It's a Spanish flu. Yeah. Killed so many last summer. Thought we'd seen the last of it. Dozens dying every week. Are the authorities doing anything? Nothing. There are so many quarantine zones in London now. It's gotten really hard to travel across town. The murders? What can you say about them? Bodies found in the streets every morning. Drained of blood. It's just horrible. Some say the sewer dog is back. The sewer dog? What's that? No one knows. People have always disappeared around these parts. The ancients say it's the sewer dog coming out to feed. But now he's killing in the streets. I just want to talk. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm not afraid, sir. It's just of other customers to take care of. I only see one customer. Oh. Well, yeah. Of course. I mean, I best check on them. What is this place? This is Tom's bar. A turquoise turtle. I'm the barmaid here, Sabrina, if you want to know. Are you always open this late at night? No, it's only since the epidemic started. 
Tom thought that people may need a safe place to stay. You don't seem to have much business. Where is everybody? Well, most people are sleeping right now. And those that are awake tend to avoid going out. What with the murders and all. I'll leave then. Thank you. <coughs> oh, God, sir. You look like Jonah's whale. Just spat you out of hell. Can I get you a drink? No, thank you. I'm not... not thirsty. Well, grab a chair and get some rest. This is gonna be another long night. Why is it going to be a long night? You must be new around here. Don't you know about the murders? Do the police have any leads on a suspect? Ah, even before the outbreak, coppers never came round here. We're on our own. People die in these parts all the time, and no one cares. Tell me more about these murders. Every morning for the last few weeks, bodies have been found. And those poor sods didn't die of flu. I'm looking for someone who might have passed through here recently. Wondered if you might help. It's been quiet tonight. The only other person I've seen went straight up to his room. <laughs> Thought it was kind of rude, actually. You mean he's still here? Well, yeah. He paid for the entire week. I need to meet this man. I have questions. Just climb the stairs and knock on the first door. I heard him open his window, so I guess he's still awake. And, sir, uh, yes? no funny business, you hear me? This is a respectable establishment. I hope I live long enough to see them where food boys get... I cannot enter. <coughs> Damn it. I think drink no longer stirs. This is no place for you. Prewen has several patrols roaming the area. They do not pursue me. But they're looking for vampires, and they're most efficient. They'll not relent until the killer has been identified. I have a common objective, but I require... Shh. I think someone is eavesdropping. Are you certain? You might as well come in, whoever you are. Slowly, vampire! <coughs> Who are you? I mean you no harm, saith the vampire. Present yourself! I... I need a word. Would... Anyone... Oh... Well, that's something I can do for you. <sighs> and who might you be? I'm not sure that I know anymore. Might I at least learn the reason of your presence? That's none of your concern. Sir, you have entered my room in the middle of the night, pale as a corpse and shaking like a tree. So please, indulge me. Something, someone, is molesting people. In fact, killing them. Biting them. The calling card of a vampire? Like you. I've been hunted down in the streets and attacked. I'm a victim here too. I... I believe you. Then if you are not a vampire, who or what are you? Dr. Edgar Swansea of the Brotherhood of St. Paul. I'm performing an independent investigation here in an attempt to understand precisely what is going on. What have you uncovered concerning the murders? 
It started a few nights ago. Rumors of violent murders. The docks have always been, shall we say, somewhat unsavory. But this is different. How different? A vampire is at work here. Famished. Reckless. It must be brought to ground, and quickly. I heard another voice, that of a woman. Who were you talking to? Ridiculous. I've no idea what you're talking about. Something tells me not to trust you. Then the feeling is mutual. And what exactly is this Brotherhood? Sir, if the name is not familiar to you, then we shall discuss it another time. Then help me find the culprit. I may. If you'll first tell me why you opened this door. I followed a trail. The scent of blood from a recent victim. It led me here. You thought I was your aggressor. That explains a great deal. We are both chasing the same shadow. Perhaps. This is all new to me. I'm not even certain what I'm looking for. You should let me handle this affair. You've no idea what you're up against. No. I will find the monster. He is mine. How will you do any better than I? But then let me ask you this. What are your intentions if you find the killer? I... I don't know yet. Hmm. Then I can only wish you good hunting. And pray we shall meet again. If Swansea is not my attacker, it means somebody else came here tonight. Someone must know something. It's a good thing you cannot see me now, Mum. It's locked, all right. Welcome back. Did you find what you were after? I can't say I have. Are you sure no one else came into your bar before I arrived? Hey, I told you, you were the only other stranger I've had. I think you're hiding something from me. I hide many things from many people, sir. That's what my job's about. Goodbye, Mr. Watts. This is God. Hello, sir. May I disturb you again? And you're still ugly as sin. I'll leave you to your bottle, then. Are they stupid or something? I've never even been to India. Evening, sir. Can I help you? I have a few questions for you. <sighs> well, if you must. I spoke to Dr. Swansea. He's not the man I'm looking for. Now, I want the truth. The truth? What do you mean? I suspect that someone else was here tonight. And I don't think Tom wants to tell me about it. I'm just the barmaid here, OK? If Tom says you're the only visitor we had, then you're the only visitor we had. I can feel your fear, madam. Please, tell me what's going on. <sighs> it's Will. William Bishop. He came in here earlier tonight and he... Well, I thought he was going to clock someone. Tell me about this William Bishop. Will was a sailor who worked at the canning factory before he lost that job. A nice bloke, really. He's never been violent. Until tonight. Why keep it a secret? Why not tell me about it? Tom's nothing, if not loyal. After Will lost his job, he offered him one ear. They used to be good mates. But recently, well... Will started to get very aggressive. I see. Thank you for your candor. I'll be sure to talk to Tom.
Damn it. I think drink no longer disturbs me. <coughs> you again. What can I do for you? Tom, talk to me about the visit from your old friend, William. Yes, Will came by tonight, but he's not my friend anymore. I need to find him. It's a matter of urgency. Do you know where he is? You could try his boat. It's up by the North Pier. He sleeps there when he's too drunk to get home. Please describe him to me. What'd you expect? He's a tall, sick bastard with a bad rash and torn old clothes. William used to be strong. Now he's a mess. Thank you, Tom. If you see him, tell him I don't want him back here unless he cleans up his act, okay? I cannot enter. Are they stupid or something? I've never even been to India. Damn it. I think drink no longer stirs me. It's locked, all right. stupid or something. I've never even been to India. I will get to the bottom of this intrigue. What's been done to me, to this city? The body is still warm. This man has just been drained of blood. This corpse has been dried of its blood, just like the previous victim. This man was armed. He tried to defend himself. What's this? Some sort of note. These men, they're a company of professional vampire hunters. Blood and empty gin bottles. This bishop fellow is something of a heavy drinker. There are blood splats on the other side of the canal. I must reach that barge.
This is no place for a gent- Over there! 